Hey guys, how's it going? It's Cypher here. Today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get recruited in the team kinetics. So there will be different sections throughout the video and there will be timestamps down in the description below if you guys need to skip to a certain part or if you just need to refresh your memory. So what we're going to be going over in this video is actually how to apply to get recruited in a kinetic. So this will go over how to apply if you want to be a competitive player where you enter tournaments and win cast prizes and things along that line. Or if you're on the sniping side of things, whether that be you're a feeder, a trick shotter, or if you just snipe for fun. And we're going to be going over content creation for you streamers and YouTubers out there who don't really want to be a competitive player and you just want to play the game, have a good time and grow your community, then we have a spot for you. And lastly, we'll be going over what Team Kinetics is all about because a lot of you probably haven't heard of us before. And I want to just explain to you what we're about Our goals that we have reached and what we can provide you as a player but before we actually get into it if you guys go ahead and hit that subscribe button it would help us out a ton but anyways let's go ahead and get to the first topic so jumping right into being a competitive player so we're only going to have two main requirements and the first one is going to be that you have at least a 1.4 kd now this may seem a little high for some of you but we really want the top of the line players and we really want to make this team as great as possible so that's why we have it that high uh, we might be able to make some exceptions but let's just try and stick to that. And our next requirement is that you be 14 and plus. Now we would have it a little lower than this, but a lot of tournaments and things along that line require you to be at least 14. So we just want to make sure that our team will be able to participate in as many tournaments as possible. Now we have a few other requirements and they're kind of small, they're kind of simple, but they're still really important. The first one is going to be that you are a good teammate. Now, we don't want to deal with no toxic people. We don't want to deal with anybody who's out here to cause problems because we've had run-ins with people like that in the past and we do not want a repeat of it. And for the second requirement is mainly just being active. We need you to show up to practices. We need you to actually compete with your team and we just need you to be a good teammate because if we have a whole team and you aren't doing your part, then you're just bringing the whole team down and we're not going to be able to play the best that we can. Now moving into actually how to apply for a competitive player, go ahead and join our discord. Once you get in here, feel free to get some roles, read the info, see what we're all about. And once you feel that you are ready to actually apply, I'm going to need you guys to scroll all the way down here and go to how to join. Scroll up to where you can see COD and go ahead and just DM this guy. Be like, hey, I'd like to join for Cold War competitive and he'll get back to you as soon as he can. Now let's go ahead and move into the sniping sort of thing. And if you're a sniper trying to get into the sniping community, this is going to be a pretty big opportunity for you because we're going to be making montages of the clips. We're going to be posting them on social media, showing all of our community what you hit and just promoting you a lot. So the way that we're going to go about recruiting snipers is we actually need you to get clips of you sniping and put it all into a video. And you can title that hashtag KZRC. And if you do that, it'll just be easier for us to notice you. And once you actually make that video you guys can go ahead into our discord and dm the same guy in the how to join channel just be like hey i would like to join with the cold war sniping team and then go ahead and send him your sniping video now make sure that you have best clips that you can possibly get whether that be five ons quads collats all of that good stuff but with all that being said let's go ahead and move into the content creation side of things so for those of you that don't want to be on the competitive team you don't want to be on the sniping team and you're a streamer or you post to youtube and you just want to grow your community we accept you too and basically we just need you to post consistently we need you to be active and we just need you to be dedicated to it we want people who are active and dedicated because we're going to be promoting you you're going to be the spotlight of our community and we really need you guys to be as active as possible because if we're out here promoting you and you barely stream or upload, it's kind of a bad look on us. And it's also a bad look on you because when we promote you, we don't want to send people over to you and they go look at your recent uploads or your streams and they like your content, but you just don't produce enough of it. So that's why we need you guys to be 100% dedicated to this. And if you're actually wondering, how would you apply again? join our discord go over to the how to join channel where you will see content creator here we'll explain who to dm you guys can go ahead and dm the leader of the content creation prom cool but that's pretty much wrapping up all of the teams that we have now if you guys are a little confused about the requirements or you feel i didn't explain it or you guys need a little more information like i said go and join our discord we'll have all that you need to know how to join channel or if you need further help feel free to ask staff we have a very active staff community here and they help people out whenever they need it. So for those of you that actually haven't heard of us before, 
We are Team Kinetics. Kinetics is an eSport organization dedicated to its community. We strive to be the top organization in the gaming scene. We accept a wide range of ages, platforms, and give almost everybody a chance to be something. We also make sure that our team has spots secured in tournaments, scrims, to not only get them prize money, but also get their name out in the esports community. And keep in mind, most tournaments will be funded or paid. We also make sure that the team is always continuously improving whether it's by reviewing and going over what we need to change or add, what could you guys have done better, by making sure that you guys are always practicing and playing at the highest level of play. We want our players to be the very best that they can be, and we make sure they're provided with what they need and what they feel would help the, the team, such as full management and organization for our players. Now, we are pretty new into the gaming scene, but so far we have reached over 3,000 subscribers on YouTube, 150,000 views on YouTube, along with 2,000 plus Discord members, and we have a few sponsors in the works with some reputable names, but we can't really mention uh, any names right now. We also offer free free graphics for your stream, your YouTube, just your brand in general to help you get out there more. Uh, we make sure we promote our players a lot, giving them more exposure to help grow their own self-identity, whether that be their Twitch stream or just get a great name in the gaming community. Now, if you're on the younger, younger side of things and you try to apply to different teams and they want to accept you because you are pretty young, then you don't have to worry here because we try to give everybody a chance to be something regardless of the age. Now, there are some implications of age because we don't create terms of service and things along that line, but it's safe to assume that we will try, that we'll try to get you a spot regardless. But that's pretty much it for the video, guys. Let me know if you enjoyed it. Let me know if you guys have any questions below. Try to respond to every single comment as possible and good luck to all of you trying to make it subscribe to us because it does help us out a lot when you guys do that because only a certain percentage of you guys are actually subscribed and if you could it takes two seconds it would help us out a ton also just one last thing if you guys are actually not interested in cold war we have many other games like i said go ahead and join the discord now to join channel you guys can see all of the games that we do actually recruit for so if you guys either get bored of cold war or you just find that you're not enjoying it as much as you were in the beginning you guys can feel free to try for any game that you guys would like as long as you meet the requirements we have other videos on this topic if you want in-depth detail on how to actually join for those certain games but basically you guys can just go ahead and dm the recruiter and he'll let you know all that you need to do but if you guys want to do support us go ahead and make sure you watch those videos it will let you in on some information that you want to get elsewhere and make sure to check out our other content because because we're slowly on the grind for 4,000 subscribers uh, we're actually trying to hit that by the end of the year our goal of 2020 was to hit 5,000 and we might not actually reach that that would mean the world to us so thank you guys for all the support and i really appreciate you guys coming through through all the videos and just showing it love it means the world to me and i'll see you guys in the next video peace